Hey peeps, welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be products that I thought I couldn't use or products that I couldn't stand, but now I'm loving them type video all over again. <laughs> so now this video, I was like, oh my gosh, I need to do this because I just, I just need to do it like... These are products that was back in the day products and I just want to just come back and just share with you guys products that I used to couldn't stand but now I love them. But if you're new, hi, I'm Beauty Body on the D. Thanks for tuning in. The subscribe button is, is here. It's free. Like, hit that button, y'all. Subscribe button, though. Like, can you, can you hit it? It's free. And if also, if you're being on a mobile device, it's free too. <laughs> but today I'm going to be talking about products that I hated or couldn't stand but I wanted to just go ahead and retest them out, give them a second chance and here they are. I'm using them. So yeah, have you ever been in that moment where you just hated a product so much and you look at your collection and you're like, um, <sighs> you're just sitting there so sad looking because I'm not using you but it's a reason why like you try to you love makeup so much are you trying to buy them with that product and it's like forgive me forgive me I'm not using you but you and I what connecting but now that bond is back so that's the whole concept of, concept of this whole video of oh, I hate it but now I love and uh, are these makeup wipes these are the fresh wet towelettes compared to Pond's original fresh wet cleansing towelettes easily removes makeup for fresh clean skin enriched with vitamin E and this is 30 wipes all together and it says um, doesn't have like a little, you know, like some brands be very dramatic with their stuff. Okay, but, <laughs> um, I hated these. Like, I really, really hated these. This is the Dollar General Beauty. Like, I really, really was not a fan of these. And I was like, I wasted a pack one time. And I was so mad at myself. I cannot stand to waste things. Like, Wasting is so disrespectful, no matter what it is. I hate wasting. So I'm like, why did I waste a whole pack? I don't want to give it to somebody else because that would be unsanitary. So I'm like, why am I wasting these? But I saw these at Dollar General the weekend I was leaving for my Charleston trip. And I, said, I need some makeup wipes right now. I need some makeup wipes. And I got my hands on these babies and I love them now. I love them. They get rid of majority of my makeup and I'm like, why did I hate this? Like, why did I hate this product so much? But it gets rid of the majority of my makeup. Majority. Is that even a darn word? It gets rid of majority of my makeup and it does what it's supposed to do. So I am obsessed and I love these. And I'm gonna bring these back if I do a, a favorite for this month. I do use LA Colors Press Powder in Cappuccino. That is my current setting powder, which is here. If I can get it to open, that's my current setting powder. <laughs> but I like to use beige, which is, of course, it is a little too light for me. And I would like to use beige, of course, it's broken. At the same time, um, I like to use beige basically under my eyes. Whenever I don't use my Maybelline Super Stay, this is like my in reach product. You know, in reach product. Like you don't feel like going all over the right, all over the room type product. Yeah, this is like it for me. So yes. <laughs> all right. Next is the Maybelline the Nudes palette. I know y'all like. You are a nudes lover. You love neutral makeup, nudes, everything. <laughs> but this this palette, it's just 
wasn't hitting it at the moment. I felt like this is a whole nother Urban Decay palette. I don't know, new, Naked palette. I felt like, you know, I just had my beef with this palette for a really, really long time because it does not have that perfect brown that I love for transitioning, like the crease color. Like, you see the crease color right here in my eye? Do you see it? Do you see it? Like, I'm gonna get close. And personal. Yeah, I'm gonna get personal with y'all. Okay. It does not have it. It does not have it in this palette. And I couldn't go back and I could not dig in and I could not get that relationship with this palette. So, obviously, I have been using it for a couple of reasons. Um, I love gold eyeshadow. You guys know I am addicted to gold eyeshadows and I just wish that it was a matte version of this. Ugh, Maybelline. Hear my cry Maybelline. Bring out bring out a matte. Okay. Bring out a matte. <laughs> Alright next is the Ruby Kisses Lux. Oh my gosh and the reason why I'm bringing this into this video it's this orange, <laughs> this orange shadow. Like, I'm a neutral person. I can walk with the green, I can walk with the shimmer color right here, and I can rock with this blue. But this orange, I was like, this orange is Tropicana. And I'm like, what am I gonna do with this? Like, now the only really thing why I really couldn't just have a ugh, relationship with it because of this big mirror. Like, that mirror is perfect. I love this mirror. But is this is orange. Like, what am I going to do with this palette? I don't want to waste this orange. I brought it. You know. But I got to where I can, you know, do a lot of things with this orange now. And I've just been like, yes. Like, yes. Okay. Next is the LA Colors. Mm. I do it every freaking time. This is the LA Girl Pro Beauty Brick in Neons. Now this palette right here was really, 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 really annoying to me. And I don't know why. Like all LA color LA mm, All of LA Girl products are nice. <laughs> but this product right here, it was just not hitting it. It was not hitting it. I couldn't get into it like it was not giving me life like you got all these gorgeous colors and this is a dupe for that Kat Von D palette if you guys know what I'm talking about I'll have it listed in the video and another dupe for that Urban Decay Electric palette this is like a really dupe but it's like oh my gosh I just the vibe wasn't there but now since I've been using it I'm running on my eyes today Mm -hmm. But the vibe has came back and it is has made it to this video, so obviously it's doing something for me now. All right, the last, well, no, not the last. I got one more product. It's this Hot Looks eyeshadow. I think I got this out of the LA Colors. Yeah, I said it right this time. The LA Colors um, collection. And the reason I'm not a glitter person, I'm not all into the shimmers. I am matte. I love matte and I'm just not all into the shimmers like that so now see I just was like hmm I wanted to come out of my comfort zone I needed something that was gonna do a great thing and I'm like dang this 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 rock for me so I like to use this color here in my inner corner like I like to use the majority of this palette itself in my inner corner so, yes. <laughs> Last but not least, I think I found my shade in the Black Radiance Color Perfect Oil Free Liquid Makeup Color Perfect Foundation. <sighs> that was a word full, a mouthful. It was everything. All right, so this one is in Mocha Honey. And I think I found it. I hated this because I felt like bruh <laughs> like every time i saw this product i felt like bruh am i ever gonna find Josh you like 
black radiance come on <laughs> like I, I was like if i don't find my correct shade i'm never going to pick up this product ever again but i believe i'm wearing it on me right now and i believe i did good i think i slayed I, I, I think the colors i think everything just slayed y'all <laughs> yay yay <laughs> <laughs> um, comment below if you know where that's from okay but yeah I think this is the correct shade and it is suitable for all skin types if you do not know but I think I did okay with this I did alright with this but yeah guys that was the products I hated couldn't stand and now they're back and they're giving me life I hope that you guys enjoyed this video give this video a big huge thumbs up hit that thumbs up hit that thumbs up and don't forget to check out the giveaway that's going on because you got 30 days 30 days <laughs> but i gotta go and i will see you soon bye i'm probably gonna be back from Charleston already I don't know like I'll probably be back by then but it's never too late so I'm gonna share with you guys what's in my makeup bag so if you saw my what's in my